Yo, what's happening, guys? It's your car guy T. I'm back again with another video. Now you're probably wondering what am I back with? You might have seen the thumbnail in the beginning, and yes, you can probably tell from the size of it. I got another matte and design modification, right? And the one that I've gone for from the length of it, you can tell that it's size skirts. Okay. Now we're not going to talk too much. We're going to get straight into the video. SSN Automotive hooked up your boy and you know put the part time for me and also hey is that time power sound just gonna have to watch the end of the video to be honest with you guys think which ones have I got in terms of the size skirts that we're going to be putting on here so excited for it to be fair let me go around and just show you guys Do you know everything I do? It's like I'm, I'm completely like new to it. Is it? Yeah. yeah, yeah. So like when I watch it, everyone do it now. It's like I'm learning as much as whoever's yeah. watching this video. No, that's good, man. How do you want it? Do you want it? Um... I want it to come. Like, do you know when you can see it a little bit? Like I don't want it to be all the way in, in it. Like, oh, it's flat, isn't it? Yeah, like that, bro. Like that. Yeah. So it's gonna be like a lip on there. It's gonna be like a little lip on there, yeah, that's gonna look nice. And then afterwards, maybe I could get like, you know, like the M Performance sticker badges and everything. Oh, like yeah, that. yeah, 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 yeah. Get that done as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna position it and work our way up. Okay. Because it's the back, really, like you want, you want, um. To stand out the most, yeah, right? Like, yeah, you want it like where you want it, innit? Do you need me to hold anything or do that? Uh, I probably will, yeah, bro, because I need you to hold it while I screw it in. <laughs> yeah, sound, I'll do that. Do you want these stickers on there or not, really? Where do I put them? Like, what stickers are they? Like the design stickers. I think they go on the side. They go like this. Probably go like that. Yeah, that's good. Do you reckon I should though? Or not? I think you can do that. You've got to put them before. You've got to put them before. You've got to put them before. Yeah, it's better in it. Yeah. 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 These are self tapping screws, so what is it? These they're good because they self tap themselves. Well, you can just screw it and it just goes straight in, yeah, into the side skirt there, and it just goes straight into the um, straight into the car. Okay, okay, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see already, we've got uh, the front lip done. Now I mean, bit by bit, easy does it. Lovely jumpy. <laughs> Do you know when I step back and look at it? Jay <laughs> done a gas, yeah, it gets me gas, but also like Jay done a good job, you know. Yeah, yeah, nah. Whew. Job, you know. Prominence detailing, guys. You see the shine on it. Oh. Very, very happy. Very, very. Yeah, that's bang on, bro. That is actually bang on. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Follows this line, yeah, and then he goes out of it. Yeah. Which is supposed to be the line, and then he goes back in again. Back in again, isn't it? Yes. Ooh. Oh, right, so bro, I've come down here myself. Uh, in terms of like experience for those, you know, young boys, girls 
that are trying to get into mechanics. What yeah. type of experience have you gone through to, that's led you to where you are now? So um, I've basically uh, done a lot of work in the past for different various different dealerships and stuff. Yeah. When I was in college, I was doing an apprenticeship. Yeah. And um, all I can say is if, you, if, your heart's, um, if your heart's in it, don't give it up and don't listen to what anyone says about the trade's gonna die and stuff. That's all I used to hear. And I never, I never let that, I never let that go. And I just carried on going and just um, gained more and more experience. And now I look today, I'm doing pretty well for myself with God's blessings as well. Um, but yeah, man, if you, if you, if you, if your heart's in it, man, don't, don't let it go. And then just, just do, do what your heart says, man. Like if, you, if you're interested in getting your hands dirty, if you wanna, if you wanna, you know, replace uh, engines, do gearboxes, anything, even bodywork, whatever. It is a graft of a job. I'm not gonna lie, but. If you you know if you want if you want to do it you can do it man and you just push yourself and you can do it anyone can do it it's not just about um, oh you have to be a boy or a guy you know girls I know I know a lot of girls that do it as well and it's it's good man it's good to see a lot of people doing it and, you know there's a lot of uh, people in the game and uh, just big up to everyone who is uh, mashing it out there as well you know that's it um, I've worked in um, like two three private garages like uh, specialists like Mercedes specialists I've worked at um, and then I've worked at, um, just like normal garages garages like private garages doing like every single manufacturer and then from there I went into uh, Arnold Clark like working for Fiat Chrysler and Jeep in dealers was doing that for about two years and then I went into Nissan got myself got, got myself a job at Nissan working um, for a GTR um, is it for D GTR uh, specialist center so he's doing like Nismo RS uh, Jukes uh, 370Zs GTRs and then just like your normal Nissans like your X-Trails your cash tries um, worked on the Navaras as well, doing like all the big kits and stuff, done a lot of that there and then um, doing a lot of uh, dealer uh, network um, work there as well and, and progress to senior technician. Mm -hmm. uh, also became an MOT tester there and then from there I managed to get a job at Aston Martin. Wow. Um, was working there um, as a as a, a prototype and special vehicle operations technician. So I was building like over a million pound uh, one-off special builds for, uh, for customers, which was a really good job. And then um, from there I managed to get into uh, McLaren in London, which is a really, really good, uh, big experience for me. Uh, working in prototype development, doing all the um, the big the big cars that were supposed to come out, um, like the P16, um, did the P14R, um, the Speedtail, um, and now um, they're all they're all uh, come out. And then I also got to work on the Senna GTR, which is my personal favourite car. Wow! Just an amazing, amazing car. That's with crazy. Eight hundred brake horsepower, but. Um, it was an amazing experience and uh, I'll never look back. And just for as a reminder, let them know who you are, bro. SSN Automotive Company Limited. Get to know, that's <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Yeah, hey. <laughs> I can't even talk right now, you know, guys. I'm too gassed. Right. Obviously, I'm going to park up somewhere and I'm going to show you how it looks in it. And I just want to say, yo, problem detailing, you got me gassed up, you know, the way my car keeps on turning next, Rue Boy, because it's shining and looking so divine, you know what I'm saying? Let me go home, guys, get myself set, and I will show you just how everything's looking, and then I'm going to talk about the next mod coming, Rue Boy. Reba? Ooh, exhaust? Ooh, I don't know! I don't know! You just gonna ah! Bye! What do you guys think? Let me know. You just heard the sound there of the car. And it sounds weak. Sometimes I'm walking away from the car thinking the car's turned off and the car's still on. That's that's how 
non-existent my exhaust sound is now what i'm thinking to do is to go for the remap first and you know we go stage one and we see how that is for a little bit then about a month after we ain't big time youtubers just yet you know we're getting that normal pay not just yet i want the pops and bangs i want it to sound loud i don't want to go for a straight pipe because i don't know how it's going to affect the mot all them type of stuff there uh, i don't want it to be doing that um but yeah man things are looking up things are looking forward for once we're gonna get that power that we've always wanted to so i'm kind of really excited about doing the stage one but if you expert he's out there watching this video right now recommend doing the exhaust first then doing the remap let me know just down below in the comments and apart from that guys i hope you've enjoyed watching this video i hope you've learned something from watching this video it's been your car guy see i'm signing out now i need you guys smash the like button if you want me to do a remap on the exhaust With a little extra sauce in there for myself. Until the next video, peace out.